Hi guys, my name is Anna and I'm so excited to tell you that I have made my debut in a K-pop music video. Everyone has been commenting, messaging me, telling me that I have appeared in Ollie London's new music video, this track. I have to be honest, I have watched it when it came out, so it's not going to be my first time reaction, but once again, I am not going to play the music because of copyright, so I will listen to it with my AirPods, but I will comment as we watch it together. So, I am just looking through his Twitter to see what he said about this music video. I'll be calling out 10 YouTubers, singers, and TikTok creators who diss me and troll me online. Be ready, Korea Boo is coming for you. Quick English lesson from Anna. <laughs> YouTubers is a plural, it's a group of people, so it's not YouTuber apostrophe S. That's just wrong grammar. It's just YouTubers with an S at the end, no apostrophe. And he put this like several times as well. Writing this song and making this video has finally given me a voice after three years of being bullied online by YouTubers apostrophe S and creators. Finally, I feel strong enough to speak out and name and shame certain people that enjoy bullying me. I want them to feel how they make me feel. Aside from the grammar and stuff, he's been harassing Jimin since 2013. And Oli, I'm sorry if you think that I'm bullying you with the videos that I made about you, but me as a Korean, or any Korean for that matter, has the right to look at your content because most of your content is about Korea. And I heard that you're teaching Korean now as well. <laughs> <laughs> Enough talking, let's go. The song is the exact same as his Korea Boo song. If he's the king of K-pop, then I am the queen of England, okay? <laughs> All of his videos are just the same concept, him dancing against like a green screen background. Hey bitches, I'm coming for you! Ooh. <laughs> oh, there's me! There's me! Okay, so he says, Priscilla, she Godzilla, her face is full of filler. She's like such a whack job. Stop hating on me, girl. You know you make me hurl. I don't watch TikTok content because I just don't have the time, so I don't know many of these TikTok creators. Please like correct me in the comments if I'm wrong. I'm guessing that she's Korean and that she's criticized Oli like I did. Her face is full of filler. So I've done my eye surgery, I've had five rhinoplasties, and I had my jawbone shaved, my chin bone shaved, my cheekbone shaved. So I did five surgeries in one day, and now I've got 24 metal screws in my face just to keep my new bone structure together. I've also had liposuction on my chest, had nipple correction, pretty much everything on my face I've done except my eyelashes, so. Bruh. Again, same with this Clyde person, I'm guessing he's a Korean TikToker. Koreans have a right to criticize your content, Ollie London, because you're trying to make money off of being like a clout chaser and a troll, so we have a right to criticize you, sorry. Catchy, they patchy, fakest girls in town. Nicole thinks she's something, but she's the fakest one around. Many people have asked me to react to Catchy. To be honest, guys, I have absolutely no problem with them because, first of all, there's an actual Korean in the group, and I can feel that they genuinely like K-pop, and they're just like, they're just very hardworking girls, you know? They sing in actual Korean, whereas Oli London, like, most of his songs are in English, and then like 10% in like this weird alien Korean language. So, no, I, I have absolutely no problem with Kachi, so yeah, that's my stance on this. He says, Monica, Monica, why you stab me in the back? Lying to the world, acting like a saint. Girl, you just a snake. I'm guessing Monica is like the person that created Catchy, if I'm not mistaken. Don't know what happened there, I don't really care, but I'm sure people have their reasons. This is not even just rapping or it's not even singing, it's just like reading words out loud. Oh, I think in the next bit, I am mentioned. I just have one line, guys. I'm very disappointed. Me? Well, that's it though. It went by so quickly. So he said, Ainaba and Anna, they hate on me all day. I mean, I don't know what I'm supposed to react to this, guys. Like, is this meant to be a diss? Because I am not offended by this at all. <laughs> when you think of diss tracks, you, I think of like Eminem or like my favorite, August D. <laughs> so many people commented saying, oh, Anna, he was so rude and he tried to cancel you. I'm like, where? Where? <laughs> is that supposed to like offend me? <laughs> I honestly want more lines. Like, this does not affect me at all. <laughs> I don't know who the next person, Rina Sawayama, is. You guys let me know in the comments, please. Honestly, I have nothing else to comment because it's just more of the same. So PewDiePie beat all of you. 12 million views, step on your shoes. I mean, yeah, he's like one of the most... Is he the most subscribed channel on YouTube? Well, he's definitely in the top like five at least. I guess I should be honored that I, sh I am mentioned along the same lines as these creators, right? <laughs> I've been on YouTube like one year exactly, one year, and I'm now at like 70 something K subscribers, which I never thought would happen. 
and it's actually I have more subscribers than on Ollie London's YouTube channel plus it's Ollie London Vivo combined so sorry Ollie like I will get my YouTube silver play button way before you if you ever get yours <laughs> this whole like monologue Ollie there is such a thing as pulse and rhythm and your rap pool for speaking whatever you're doing it's just all like not on the beat at all I suggest next time you make this one of these you try to like flow to the beat more I suggest listening to August D mixtapes if you want inspiration because it's awesome okay hold on Advasion, I need persuasion I think you're such a fan and you're spelt Y-O-U-R he's meant to write I think you apostrophe R-E because he's he's saying I think you are such a fan but he put I think you're such a fan this is wrong this is incorrect grammar and he's a native British person he should know stuff like this this is like one of the basics of like English Ollie if you ever want Korean or English lessons just hit me up and I'll be happy to help you out honestly I'm just bored of this I'm honestly bored all of his music videos are the same and to be honest I think I can edit better in my sleep I can do a better effort than this you know, I'm just going through his Twitter again and he says my pronoun is Korean slash Jimin more like delusional psycho <laughs> sorry if watching this music video has inspired you to try and make your own music video and your own song you can do so with the sponsor of this video Skillshare Skillshare is an online learning community where you can come and take the next step in your own creative journey with thousands of inspiring classes on topics such as music, music production, film and video, marketing, graphic design, creative writing, all of that good stuff. So because I do some covers on YouTube, I am taking this class currently called Learn How to Mix Music with Young Guru. He is a Grammy nominated legendary audio engineer. So even if you want to try and create your own covers at home, you can learn how to mix the sounds well. I use GarageBand personally on my Mac, but it's just very nice to take tips from an actual audio professional. And Skillshare is curated specifically for learning, which means there are no ads. They're always launching new premium classes so you can stay focused and follow where your creativity takes you. So the first thousand to click the link in the description will get a free trial of Skillshare premium membership. So you can go and check out these classes on whatever you want. So go check it out. Thank you for watching, like and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one.